All right, fam. So it is Thursday. Back in motherfucking Albany. I am going to do um uh probably some chest some chest work, some arm work with the dumbbells. Um I think I'm gonna try to change the order that I do it in because it's usually cold as fuck in this gym. Um so if I do my cardio first, of course I'm drenched after my cardio. So I'm on I think I'm gonna I'm gonna, I think I'm gonna live first and then do cardio. That way I can just leave right after. I won't have to be freezing the whole time I'm in the gym because it definitely kills the mood or the vibe that I that I'm a mode that I'm in when I'm um about to lift. I want to lift and be cold like and if you know me, you know I prefer the heat. I prefer to run in the heat. I prefer to work out outside in the heat. Um, so if I'm in the cold, it really like zapping my my whole energy. So that's what's finna go on. I'm finna get my bag together and I'll check in in a minute. fam so i am leaving from my workout had a good one uh like i said i hit chest buys and tries um worked out well me with me lifting first just because it's cold it's uh colder in the gym but typically i do my cardio first that way i can deplete all of my stored glycogen the stored carbs and that way I get directly into the fat burn after about 35, maybe 40 minutes of cardio. 
So I like to do that first. Um, and then the intensity of my workouts is still high, so I'm burning fat or even more fat during that whole process. So um, that went good. Um, I, I lifted a, not heavy, but I got up to the 100 pound dumbbells, which um, um, since I'm a couple weeks out from a show, I've heard people usually like taper back, but that's not something that I'm willing to consider. So on that note, um, there are, are a lot of different protocols or um, ways to do this or that when it comes to preparing for a show and what you should and shouldn't do based on that. But my goal isn't only to compete in shows. The way that I train is for a lifestyle, right? So that, that's why I can maintain being lean year round. And if you've been following me on social media for a while, you know this is not nothing new.